Hi everyone, this is Rob from lifehackingdiy.com. So today I wanted to talk about uh, the life hack of stripping your furniture, electronics, or other goods of the hardware on them, basically the nuts and bolts and potentially the screws, just because a lot of times you can come in handy and you can find ones that are kind of hard to find or oddly shaped, which can come in useful. So right here are some big fat ones which I got from an office chair, which are kind of hard to find. They're a little unique. Uh, I wanted to show these. I took apart a table. So I was going to throw it away. I sawed it in half and to get it to fit in my garbage bin. But before I tore everything up, I saw there were all these bolts in there. The thing about bolts is that because they're just tied to a nut, they're still in really good condition. Where a screw, you know, a screw goes in and maybe it gets... At the very least, the screw gets dirty, but it might get bang mangled. You know, maybe the head gets a little messed up, something like that. But bolts are pretty, they're normally pretty hardy, and they don't really get much wear and tear because they're just sitting in the, fur the furniture once it's in. So I'm showing these bolts, which I got, because I'm actually using them in the stool that I made. There's bolts here. There's bolts here. Um, and it's just a really good idea to strip furniture of this sort of stuff. Especially the bolts, screws, not as much, and nails. I wouldn't bother with nails just because a lot of times they'll be crooked, stuff like that. So, for example, you see this. This is my bin. I have several of these of just parts I've accumulated over the years of taking stuff apart that should come in useful later. Or at the very least, I mean, now it's in your hand and it's not in a landfill. Okay, so that's my tip. Thanks for watching.